Hi Libra, welcome back to my channel. I'm here to do your weekly messages. Okay, so I'm gonna start with the Rebel deck. Let's see what kind of messages come out for you for the upcoming week for my Libras. We have, you need some fucking yoga in your life. Ancient shit is cool. Maybe you need a woosah a little bit. <laughs> woosah, boo boo, woosah. <laughs> then we have, you are being shady. Watch out, shit could get ugly. Ooh, you being shady. Who you throwing shade at, boo? Zane, I see you. Okay. And my cards fell. Shit. Shit. Hopefully it's not me you're throwing shade at, because I'll throw shade back. No. <laughs> it says, don't talk to anyone. Don't look at anyone. You need some fucking time alone, and you know why. Ooh, maybe that's why you're throwing shade. <laughs> Ooh. All right, we have winning you got a good thing going don't ruin that shit uh-oh we'll see what's that it what, what's, what's going on libra damn okay so we have fertility okay fertility you are definitely you could either get pregnant getting pregnant already pregnant about to conceive or you could this could literally mean that you are giving birth to your dreams you are manifesting something okay and you are nurturing it mothering it um we have playfulness oh slippery little sucker playfulness some of you could be you know out there living your best life <laughs> dancing singing going with the flow funny as i said that I literally going with the flow card here okay no matter what because we have the heartache and loss. So there could have been something. This is probably why you're throwing shade. I'm just saying. There could have been something someone said in regards to a lover. Or this could have been a friend or whatever. And you are just, you know, maybe you had to take a loss in something. Or maybe someone walked away from you. Or maybe someone said something they weren't supposed to. Or maybe you did. Or whatever that is. You are just, you've learned to really pretty much... Go within, go within and just go with the flow. You're just going with it, you know, you're not letting things really bother you, but when it when they do, you really snap. Okay, so you just be careful because shit could get ugly just like that card said. <laughs> then we have the spiritual strength. With the spiritual strength, we have beyond illusion. So, this is you really going within, seeking truth and honesty. You are just focusing on what's what's real what's real what's worth beating yourself you know over what's what's worth the fight what's worth getting all worked up over you know dropping the drama letting go of drama really going with the flow of life being you know not taking things so serious with the playfulness card just being happy you know what i mean that's that's what i feel like you're doing um and this is you not being afraid to, to dream, to daydream, to fantasize. Beyond illusion is really like you are just transforming the way you think, the way you see things. And not a lot of people get that because, you know, some people will call you weird or whatever. But that's only because they don't get your beautiful mind. And yeah, I said it. You have a beautiful mind. So um, with the spiritual strength, you know, you've really had to endure a lot of things in your life. And it took it had to be that way because spirit wanted you to be close to them. And when spirit wants you close to them, they bring on all kinds of heartache and loss because they are trying to get your attention. They want you to go within. They want you to be spiritually strong and connected to spirit and to be a good person. And not only for yourself, but for humanity. And that's exactly what needed to happen. And so this upcoming week, you're realizing that. And you're just going with the flow is what that's the thing going with the goddamn flow <laughs> and then we have the moon reverse so something could be coming to light okay there could have been a secret coming out catch probably got you all worked up or maybe you are releasing some type of secret maybe you were holding telling someone that you were pregnant or something came out that someone else was pregnant or you whatever that could be one scenario i'm just saying um and you made the decision to finally come out and say it because the two of swords is reversed. So this is definitely uh, telling the truth, bringing it out into the world, okay? Or someone could be coming to you saying that, saying something. The Son of Wands could be 
uh, a small boost of energy that universe gives to you or something that really sparks your creativity that gets you going that, that really fires you up what fires you up what keeps you going you know what I mean are you going to protect that with the snake it's like snakes represent protection and strength and shedding your old self and transformation and because we have the Son of Wands, I definitely feel like you are taking on this whole new side of you. Like a strength, passion, power, the energy to, to really just get on your fucking A game. Despite what people think or say. Staying in your goddamn lane. Remembering who you are. Fixing your crown. Whether you're male or female. You know what I mean? Like definitely... Going with the flow. I'm sorry. I can't help but just think that. That's you right there. In the midst of it all. Going with the flow. That's what I see you doing this week. So. <laughs> and it took a lot of bullshit for you to just feel, realize it. All it takes is for you to just take it day by day. Go with the flow. Don't stress about people, places, or things, or nothing. Okay? Alright, so um, with that being said, this is your message for the upcoming week. Please get a thumbs up, like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you in your next video. Bye-bye.